hello queens welcome back for another wash and go review so we're going to be using the dark and lovely clump and curl clay cleanser to actually co-wash my hair today following that with the petal fresh tea tree conditioner and for deep conditioning i use the allocate naturals honey and sage deep conditioner this is a staple i love this deep conditioner for the set and style, um, we're going to be using the Eden Body Works All Natural Coconut Shea Leave-In Conditioner. My favorite castor oil from the Vitamin Shop. It is a lightweight castor oil. And then lastly, we'll be using the Clumping Clay Cream Gel from Dark and Lovely All Natural as well. I received this back in a couple of months ago in one of my curl kits. So we're going to start off using the actual leave-in conditioner. You guys know I love this conditioner. It is my favorite one. And we're just going to heavily apply this all over the section. You guys will also notice too that throughout this video, I will definitely be misting my hair with more water. So you always want to make sure that you have at least a spray bottle on hand to add more moisture back into your hair. So this is what it looks like with only the leave-in on my hair. And then again, I'm going to go in and mist my hair. And you guys will see me doing this throughout the video. I find that for wash and goes now, my hair is more kinky. And with it being more kinky, I have to make sure that I have plenty of water actually on my hair. So now going in with the castor oil, we're going to apply that on top of the leave-in. This is the O for my lock method. I always do this um, method for any of my wash and goes. Um, so going forward, if you guys see any more wash and go reviews, you will definitely always see me using the lock method. Now going in with the clumping um, cream gel from Dark and Lovely. I have just fallen in love with this product. Um, right now they say you can find it at Target and I'm not sure if it's available online or in store as well. So just check out Target.com. I will leave the links to all the products used down below in the description bar for you guys. But I'm just going to work this in and as you can see it definitely makes your curls clump up upon itself. I just love this gel, this cream gel. This is literally the only gel that I will actually go in with on my natural hair for a wash and go. And then again, I'm going to go in and mist my hair with more water. I just find again that for my wash and goes now that my hair has gotten a lot longer as well as thicker. Water is the key component to my wash and goes. So if my hair isn't somewhat saturated or if it isn't already fully saturated, I will not get the definition that I'm looking for. So this is what my hair looks like after doing pretty much almost 80% of my head. And again, you guys can see that my hair actually has dried up quite a bit too. And that's another thing that I love about this clumping um, clay gel, you guys, is that the drying time for my wash and goes is literally cut in half. Like my hair will literally dry in about two, two and a half hours. And I can just go on about the rest of my day without having to worry about having a wet head. That is so annoying when you have to go out the rest of your day with a wet head because you're waiting for the products to actually set and style onto your hair and with using the cream gel from dark and lovely i find i don't have to worry about that so going in with more of the eden body works coconut shea leave-in i'm just going to apply that all over this section and of course in the front my texture is a lot more kinkier than in the back so i always now have to definitely make sure that my hair is just soaking wet for it to actually give me the definition that I look for and to actually separate to clump upon itself. So we're just going to continue to work this leave-in in you guys. I mean to me leave-ins and curl defining creams are re really make your leave-ins, I mean I'm sorry your wash and goes pop. So as you can see my hair is already clumping up just with the actual leave-in itself. I'm going in with some more oil and then we're going to go in with some more of the clump and curl cream gel from dark and lovely um if you guys are interested in joining curl kit this is how i received this product you can save 10 percent off of your first curl kit by using my link down below so definitely check that out if you're interested in the curl kit you guys and you definitely don't want to miss out on the may curl kit that's coming up soon so I'm just going to go through and as you guys can see, I'm just pretty much shingling, going through and trying to get each strand um, separated to pretty much clump up upon itself and give that definition that I'm looking for.
So as you guys can see, pretty much from just simply applying the cream gel, my hair instantly begins to clump up. And here is a slow-mo for you guys. Like, I just love this cream gel. If you guys haven't tried it, you're definitely late to the game. Please get your hands on this curl defining cream gel because it is definitely the bomb. So now we're gonna shake, shake, shake. I find with doing this, this helps to further get my curls to clump up on themselves, especially in the back because with my hair being so long. And I'm just gonna continue to just probably do this a couple more times, but be careful. You don't want to give yourself whiplash. Just gently shake around your hair so that way your curls can clump up upon themselves. And then you might want to actually take the ends and scrunch them up in your hands to even create more definition. But again, I'm just gonna shake, shake, shake until I get the definition that I'm looking for. And that will pretty much be it for my wash and go. The only thing is now, I'm just gonna have to wait for it to dry. Again, it only takes it about a couple of hours or so. But right now, this is my hair with it actually still damp. And then this is what my hair looks like when it is fully dry. So as you guys can see, it definitely did shrink up upon itself. Um, I just love how my curls are always super defined after using this cream gel from Dark and Lovely. And my hair is always lightweight. It's never heavy. It doesn't feel weighed down or anything like that. And that's another good thing. And again, my hair is very moisturized. It will be like this for the remainder of the week. And I won't have to even worry about moisturizing my hair when I actually probably reset and style my curls. So that's pretty much it for this video, you guys. Again, check out Target.com so you can get your hands on this product. And I'll see you guys in my next upload. Bye, queens.